So Hugh, what's been happening in March? We have come out of build mode, finally, we are in the wild with Carter. It's actually been a huge month. Now we have all of the cogs spinning. So what does that actually mean? We've, we've done a ton of work on the conversational engine, which is our core product. It's an API that basically when you send a text or audio message from a player to our API, you get a response from a simulated character back. And so getting that right has been really, really important. We have a brand new conversational engine that's incredibly good at simulating characters, if I do say so myself. It's also got other cool tools built in, so you could describe the agent's worldview and the agent's goal and what the agent does and doesn't like and how the agent speaks. Layered on top of that, we have something called the moderator sandwich, which allows us to moderate things going into the conversational engine and coming out, so that may, way we have great AI safety layers built in. How are you gonna design an agent? Well, we've just finished off our work on the Carter Studio. It's a web app that allows you to configure these agents just through text. So you can just go through our wizard, or show it on the screen now, and you can basically just describe who do you wanna simulate? Is it a male, female? Is it an ogre? What's their name? How old are they? What year is the game set? All of that stuff. Then you can go into the advanced settings, which is the aspects of their personality. Like I said, the world view, how they talk, their talking style, all of that stuff. And at the end of it, you can talk in our web app to that agent. That character can be accessed fully through our API with just a simple API key. But you can also share the character with a public link to anyone else who wants to talk to that character. And the idea behind this is that we actually just want to allow people to share these characters with their friends, with people on their teams, to show what Carter is capable of. And we're already starting to see people do that, which is super exciting. So how do people consume the API? APIs are pretty straightforward. One of the easiest ways is to actually give people open source projects and packages on GitHub to basically just download and start using. So we've launched a brand new Unity package, which allows people like Haywa, who's our game dev, to quickly get Carter into the game. The characters that you're conversing with are having a really good conversation. They're really aware of what's happening in the game, but also remembering things from the past. So if you say to a character, you know what, I, I hate going to the mountains in this game. It's a really long way and I just don't want to go there the character will actually remember that and persist it over time. So because we're out of the wild, we are pleased to be testing with not just our Discord community now, but the first few game studios, which are really, really positive. And we've had some amazing quotes, including that this is the first time in ages they've actually wanted to hear a response from, a, from an NPC in a game. We're also working on our first proper large mobile game, and it's completely powered by Carter. So it's a super peaceful, zen game that Hay was working on. You can farm, you can go up to characters and talk to them and get to know them. It'll be on iOS and Android. So just a couple other things that we've done this month. It's been a busy one. So we have a new office. Here it is. This is our actual office. This is not temporary. We're just one floor under the old one. Finally, we are now hiring another Python developer to look after some of the infrastructure on the conversational engine to improve it and to also help scale it as we talk to more and more game studios and as more and more people fall in love with Carter. And on top of all of that, we are now making inroads for next month in content. So we wanna show people what Carter can do, but also we wanna become a voice in the AI NPC world. And so the best way to do that is through our podcast and through weekly challenges building with Carter on YouTube, Spotify, and we'll share more of that as it comes out. This has been March. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.